everybody super random video but it's just kind of a pain in the butt uh if you have any of these systems for heating this uh is a burn them um and you're getting an error message or let's say you have an older system that's just not working and sometimes what might be happening is you would be hearing the uh the damper motor making like a weird buzzing noise that means that the motor is shot so this was the old motor um what often you see is people replacing this entire assembly with the motor it's like i think usually like two or three hundred dollars it's a whole lot more work you don't have to do all that if and i'll tell you why if and you know, what that criteria is so you can easily buy just the motor and that's like 130 bucks a lot cheaper so all you have to do is remove two screws one screw up here and same thing down here is another screw remove that it's a simple clip for the wiring I'm not sure you can see that but that clip comes out you swap the motors out done so this was the old faulty motor you just line up the uh the blade that turns the the damper inside so when it's in this up and down position like this that means that the damper is open so this is damper open so the damper is just going straight vertical like that and when it's horizontal obviously the damper is closed so one way you know you can just get by with replacing the motor is once you take the old faulty motor off again two screws and that's it what you're gonna do is this bar here just spin it with your hand see if it's freely spinning and if it is that means there's no uh, restrictions inside nothing is stuck okay so that means that this entire portion here is fine does not need to be replaced and you don't have to pay a whole lot more to get an entire motor and vent assembly all you have to do is buy that motor which is again 130 bucks i'll put a link in the description i think that one is like universal it kind of fits most uh of those damper styles and it doesn't matter the uh the diameter of your piping because i know it says you know like for example right here gvd uh dash six that just means it's a every a six inch diameter others will be eight five four whatever that doesn't matter when you're replacing just the motor because the motor is the same uh no matter what so that's what you will do okay and uh one way to figure out that your motor is the issue is one it's either going to be making a noise uh two uh let's say it's not making a noise you can just remove the motor and if this is spinning fine that means your motor is shot because there's no restriction there's no uh, friction for the motor to be struggling against it that means it's just shot so that's a few ways to figure it out uh, and to get you by let's say it's an emergency you don't have the part uh, and you want to get heat going what you can do is manually grab this and turn it so it's vertical going straight up and down and also there's a switch here on the side you can set that to manual uh, what that means that it's just going to be pretty much kept in this manual mode of vertical which will allow some cold air to enter the chimney but it'll get you by in a pinch for a, a week or so till you get the right part so i'll put the link in the description for that guy um, for anybody that struggled with this stupid uh vent damper motor whatever you call it all right take care bye